Hello everybody, welcome to a brand new video, and today we are going to talk about how to get the Cannonballer Badge. Now, if you don't know what the Cannonballer Badge is, it is a badge inside of Shark Bite. So, the way to get this badge is by hitting the shark with the cannonball fired from the pirate ship by clicking on the cannons. But as you see, it's practically impossible, even rarer than the Titanic. So, the reason why it's so impossible is because it doesn't actually work. So I'm going to get my alt account to just walk over to a specific area where I can tr test it out. I've tested this out before, but I was not recording, so now I shall try it. So there are two ships with cannonballs, the pirate ship and the Dutchman. And both of them have cannonballs. So you would think, huh, that's uh, pretty strange how it only talks about the pirate ship being the badge. Oh, if my alt account just moves a little. And right there I hit it, but I did not get the badge. As you see, that did quite a big amount of damage. But I did not uh, actually get the badge. Alright, now I'm at super low health, and I'm going to try and kill my alt account with it. So what this should do is this should, uh, this should give me an even higher chance to get the badge. You think? And I killed it, but I did not get the badge, and I didn't get any teeth as well. That's pretty cool though that I was able to kill my alt account with a uh, cannonball, but I did not get the badge. As you see right here, I'm on my uh, main account, mostly pixels, and if I refresh, I still do not have the cannonballer badge. So that makes no sense. Why is it that I do not have the cannonballer badge even though I shot myself with a cannonball? So now we're gonna try it with the Dutchman because that has to work, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my alt account who has never shot a cannonball before the hit the shark with the first cannonball that's ever hit on its account. So maybe it's the first cannonball you've ever shot is the only cannonball that can give you the badge. Because a few people are still getting it every single day. As you see, five won it yesterday. So I'm going to grind out uh, a few teeth and get my alt account the pirate ship. So I'm going to try to hit him with a cannonball. But this time it's going to be in the Dutchman. As you see, that was a direct hit, and I did nothing. I got no badge whatsoever. And that was actually a pretty nice shot. That was actually a very nice shot, but I got no badge, as you saw. Alright, so now I'm going to pick up my alt account, which I ac accidentally didn't invite to the same ship. And I'm going to try and get them to shoot it, their first ever cannibal shot, into the shark. Because, as you saw right there, I did not get the badge, and I was in, and I was using the Dutchman. So that eliminates one of the possibilities. Oh, big brain? Oh, huge mega brain! Oh my gosh, that was mega brain. All right, now I know what to do. If you ever get stuck on... <laughs> Whoa, that's so mega brain. All right, so if you ever get stuck outside your Dutchman or pirate ship or Titanic, you can ducky boat up it. And this is a bot right here. As you see, he's... He says the exact same thing over and over and over again. All right, so now we're going to try and hit the uh, the really weird guy. He uh, he seems to be macroing or whatever, and uh, very very strange. But uh, we're gonna try and get my alt count to yeah. You see, he goes and then he tr spins around, and then he boosts a specific direction. All right, so if my alt count gets lined up perfectly then I will take the shot. But I do not trust this guy because eventually his boost will come in and he'll boost toward us. Like that. Hopefully he just stays over there. He's boosting, boosting, and now he's spinning. Now we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. Go, go, go. Aim, aim. No, no. I don't want to take the shot. I don't want to mess up. 
it's terrifying. If I miss the shot, I just lose. He's awfully close. And he can boost at any second. Because he's macroing or whatever. I just need him to, like, hit a landmass. Or I just need to get the perfect line up. Because I do not want to mess this up. Plus, time is running out. I could just wait until someone else gets it. But I really want to try and get it. Is he going to walk this way? Nope, he goes the other way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stay there, stay there, stay there. For the next 82 seconds, please. Soon he'll turn around or he'll get... Yeah, he'll stop getting being stuck right there. Oh, he's going to boost away again. I feel like he's going to boost right into me. Well, kind of. Oh, yes, kind of. Oh. Oh, he's right underneath me. <laughs> Should I take the shot? Boost, boost. Go, 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 go. Take the shot, take the shot. No! <laughs> I messed up. He was right there. Oh, my gosh. Use the reload glitch and absolutely annihilate him. Alright, so I think that's got to do it with today's video. Please tell me if you guys actually do, actually are able to get the cannonball or badge, because I've tried absolutely everything, and I just can't get it. But uh, five people can today. So, thank you guys for watching, and I shall see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. Also, pretty cool update with the short fin Mako and the Shark Blast and the Research Boat. I want to try and find if there's a glitch for that, and my, hopefully, hopefully my, uh, boat, five boat glitches video comes out, uh, pretty soon. And I will also want to make a entire tier list or video comparing every single weapon. Because the Shark Blaster actually has some decent stats. I would say it's even better for the ray gun because it fires so fast you can use the reload glitch on it. Plus, the short fin Mako is uh, it's pretty good. The Mosasaurus is obviously the best, but it was actually nerfed. The boost is nerfed by a ton, and the and sadly the Mosasaurus isn't as fast, which is good. But you can't have uh, pretty much world record speed run, you know, game anymore. What? Did you see that? <laughs> I saw that. Somebody doing that in, like, a lobby before. And I just realized that is possible. So you don't actually need an auto clicker or FPS unlocker or anything to get out. All you need to do is walk up to that wall. And as you saw right there, I'll slow-mo for it for you. Just walk up to the wall and click it. And now you're out of the map. Wow, that is much easier than I thought. And, uh, yeah. If you guys are seeing this and you stuck to the end... Thank you guys for watching, and yeah, that's a really cool tip.